Following his father's footsteps, Devin Booker is becoming a force to reckon with. Kobe saw it before he left us saying that his mentality is rare yet important. He's a very important piece to the puzzle with Chris Paul and DeAndre Ayton of the Phoenix Suns. In today's video, we'll be talking about his net worth, crazy lifestyle, and how he spends his millions. Booker born as Devin Armani, Booker on October 30th, 1996, is a valuable commodity right now. Born in Grand Rapids, Michigan to Veronica Gutierrez, a cosmetologist, and Melvin Booker, a former basketball player and coach. Following in his father's footsteps, he grew up playing basketball for the Grand Rapids Hoops of the Continental Basketball Association. Booker's father was devastated when he didn't get his selection in the 1994 NBA draft. At various points in his career, he suited up for the Houston Rockets, the Denver Nuggets, and the Golden State Warriors. Booker's parents never tied the knot, thus they shared parenting duties from time to time when he was an infant. His two half-siblings are Devin Wade, his older brother, and Maya Powell, his younger sister. Since she was a child, his younger sister had microdeletion syndrome, a chromosomal disease. Booker lived with his mother while his father was at the height of his career, and every summer his father would come to visit and teach Booker everything he knew about basketball. Booker has been a basketball fan and player since he was a little child, so it is only fitting that he played on the school's team. His father intended him to attend Booker's Almo School, the Moss Point School District in Mississippi, but he started his basketball career at Granville Public School in Michigan. To be closer to his son, his father recently retired from professional sports and taken a coaching position at a local high school. After convincing his mother, he moved to Mississippi, where his father began coaching him and where he quickly improved his skills, especially in terms of his shooting and general form. He was named the Mississippi Player of the Year by the Sun-Herald after he finished his sophomore year of high school with more points than anyone else on the squad. Booker was nominated to the Division 7 5A All-Division team and named the MVP despite playing with some minor injuries during his junior title season the following year. His 2014 season saw him ranked by ESPN as the 18th best player in the high school. In his senior year, he participated in the LeBron James Skill Academy and Kevin Durant Skills Academy. The CP3 Elite Guard Camp the Nike Global Challenge and the NBPA Top 100 Camp. When Booker finished high school, he headed straight to the University of Kentucky. His college squad, the Wildcats, featured future NBA stars Tyler Eulis and Carl Anthony Towns. Despite only having played for one season, Booker was named to the SEC All-Freshman Team, All-SEC Second Team, and SEC Sixth Man of the Year. His decision to enter into the 2015 NBA Draft was publicly confirmed not long after. Booker was drafted by the Phoenix Suns in the first round of the 2015 NBA Draft and has played there all of his professional career. He set an NBA record by becoming the youngest player ever to score more than 60 points in a game. Booker set an NBA rookie record for points in a game with 70 on March 24, 2017. He was named to the NBA All-Star Rookie First Team after averaging 13.8 points 2.6 assists, and 2.5 rebounds, and starting all 30 games. Booker almost recorded a triple-double in the Suns game against the Minnesota Timberwolves on November 23, 2019, scoring 35 points and grabbing a career-high 12 rebounds, while dishing out 9 assists to show that he was worth the Suns' investment in him during the 2019-2020 season. He had a stretch of seven games where he scored at least 30 points, including a loss against the Memphis Grizzlies in which he scored 40 points. The streak broke a record held by Charlie Scott twice and Charles Barkley for the most consecutive 30-plus game streak. Booker was snubbed in the 2021-2022 season for not being named the league MVP. Any other season, he runs away with it. Nonetheless, Booker didn't complain. He had his fan base do that work for him. His main focus is to bring a championship back to Phoenix. Booker has only been in the NBA for a short time, but his value continues to rise because of his success in the league. Booker's 2018 signing with the Sons of the five-year contract worth a total of $158,253,000 underlined this trend. Booker made $31,650,600 for the 2021-2022 NBA season. In the 2023-24 NBA season, Booker will earn a maximum of $36 million from the Suns as part of his contract. Booker signed the highest deal ever signed by a player for the Phoenix Suns in 2018, having started out with a net worth of only $2 million. He earned approximately $65 million by the end of 2021. On top of that, his present wealth is reportedly around $30 million. 
He is also known to have dated Kendall Jenner, a member of the famed Kardashian-Jenner family, and a supermodel and social media sensation in her own right, due to Jenner's history of rumored relationships with professional basketball players like Ben Simmons, Blake Griffin, and Jordan Clarkson, their romance has been the subject of much media attention. Jenner fires off a retaliatory tweet to all the haters out there. Despite the debate, the couple is still together and seems to be having a great time together despite the state of the world's health. Booker is primarily concerned with his basketball career and thus does not share many details regarding his acquisitions and assets with the media. However, he had made a few notable purchases in the past that have generated headlines including a lavish property. Booker spent $3.25 million on a home in a high-end subdivision in 2017. This 5,600 square foot building is found close to the intersection of Scottsdale Road and Lincoln Drive and features a contemporary design. The home features four bedrooms, each with its own bathroom, a dining room, a wine cellar, an outdoor living area, and a chef's kitchen with a view. There are also four parking spaces. After three years, he sold it in October of 2020 for $3.45 million. He purchased a desert oasis in Paradise Valley, Arizona in 2019. Quote, when someone approaches the house, it's deceiving because it appears there's not much going on. Devin said of the home, which he purchased in 2019. But once people enter and they see the pool, the yard, and all the adjoining rooms, they're taken aback. I love how seemingly straightforward home can still be a big reveal. Devin's cool and stylish home is designed to entertain his friends, many of whom are very tall NBA teammates. Those touches include 12-foot-long sofas for the guys to be able to comfortably stretch out on, and custom poker table with plenty of legroom. The clear sign of Kendall's presence is a James Terrell LED wall sculpture that hangs in his dining room. The model has one of her own by the artist called Scorpius in her her home tour. Kendall's sister Kylie Jenner and Kim Kardashian have also have the artist's LED wall sculptures in their mansions as well, along with a large airy kitchen and great room for pals to gather, a huge pool that takes up almost most of the backyard, and a guest house that he converted into a stylish man cave featuring a pool table and other games. Devin's home is his sanctuary amid his hectic NBA seasons. Remember the time Devin Booker drove his pimped-out Chevrolet Caprice to the 2021 NBA Finals? After that, the NBA player became famous amongst people who have an interest in cars all around the globe. As would be expected, the guy has several more sought-after cars stored in the garage of his residence. Booker allowed architectural design access to his garage as part of a home tour. He flaunted a couple of spotless Buick Grand Nationals and admitted that he has a soft spot for Chevy Impalas in the piece. Quote, I'm a classic car collector. I think it's a family tradition for me that I took on and honed in on, Booker said. Asked which of the rides was his favorite, Booker said that this was an unfair question to throw at him. Quote, people always ask me what's my favorite. It's like picking your favorite child. You just don't do that. He said before promptly leading the crew to his most beloved ride, his 1959 Chevrolet Impala named Pretty Penny. Eventually, Booker hopes to expand his car collection enough to fill an entire warehouse. He also shared that his grandfather is one of his inspirations for getting into collecting cars. Quote, my grandpa, I remember going to his house growing up. He'd be underneath his car every time I got there. I never got that privilege to spend time with him in the garage, but he loves that I'm collecting and hopefully I can get a warehouse and we can expand further. Booker is active in the community and gives back when he can. Working with the Sun's Charities Board of Directors, he committed $2.5 million to be distributed among five charities this year. Booker gave $100,000 in and around Phoenix and helped organize a fundraiser to support the area while it was under lockdown due to the worldwide health crisis. What do you think about Devin Booker's luxurious lifestyle? Let us know in the comment section below. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one.